And Antonio, police say that a driver who was killed early this morning on a West Side Highway appears to have been the one that caused the crash. Both that driver and a passenger died in what police are calling a wrong way crash. It shut down the westbound side of Highway 90 near General McMullen for hours. Katrina Weber spoke to a witness who says he knew instantly that no one in that car could survive. This was a scene that the driver of an 18-wheeler told San Antonio police he saw coming and tried to prevent. In the end, though, they say he wasn't able to steer clear of the white sedan heading his way on westbound Highway 90 near General McMullen. The car was coming with a one way, so he hit the trailer and he spun around. Roberto Solis wasn't able to divert his eyes both during and after the two vehicles collided. At just before three this morning, he was wrapping up things at home before heading to an appointment. I was outside with the dog, taking the dog outside so he could do his thing. Instead, it was Solis who had to do something, call 911 for help. Police confirmed what he told us, that the car driver was going the wrong way on the highway. Both the driver and passenger in the car, a 22-year-old man and 21-year-old woman, were killed. Solis told me he knew right away that this couldn't be good. He says right after that crash, everything went deadly silent. They stayed there. And so nothing else, they couldn't move or anything. For hours, traffic investigators stayed there too, trying to piece together what happened and why. The westbound side of the highway, meanwhile, remained closed for most of the morning, leading to a big backup. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News.